welcome to Nilsa YouTube channel. My name is Ram Mishra and I am your online instructor. So what's in this video? In this video I will tell you how to upgrade Terraform to the latest version. So guys let's begin the topic. But before start the lab session we have to understand few points which is what is Terraform and its use cases. Terraform is a popular infrastructure as a code tool is known for its simplicity and flexibility in managing and provisioning tech stacks. However, as with any software, it is essential to keep up with the latest version to benefit from new features, improvements and bug fixes. So in this demo, I will guide you how you can upgrade your Terraform version. So let's begin the lab session. As you can see, uh, this, is, this is my Linux machine and currently I am in my Linux terminal. Let me show you the OS release version and Terraform version first of all. So cat etc product release. You can see currently I'm using RHEL 9.2 and if I go with Terraform hyphen version, you can see the version is 1.5.1 and uh, I'm getting uh, all, I've got the message also. My current Terraform version is out of date. The latest version is 1.6.0. You can update by giving this URL, right? So in this video, we will see how we can upgrade Terraform using TF environment command line tool, TF ENV command line tool. So start with the first step which is install TF ENV tool and verify its installation. But before we go to the installation part of TF ENV, let's get understand what is TF ENV is. So TF ENV, ENV, Terraform environment uh, is a version tool for Terraform maintained by the open source community on GitHub under the MIT open source log license. Keep in mind, it is not an official tool by HashiPub, right? So let's install TF ENV command line tool on Linux. So first of all, we need to clone the GitHub repository using the following command. So I have write down the command here in my notepad. Let it be copied from here. So that's a command git clone https github.com slash tfutil slash tfenv.git and clone it inside my current user home directory dot tfenv folder right so for further references i will share this repo path in my description also you can reference from there now you can see it successfully cloned let me go with the rest minus a here you will find out dot tfenv folder right so you can see TF ENV folder is available after cloning GitHub repository. Now it's successfully cloned. Let's update the path variable using the following command. I need to update my path variable also. So let me go with echo export command, copy, paste, echo in single course export path variable dollar home dot TF ENV slash bin dollar path and update my dot bash profile. So I updated my path variable in my current user bash profile. Now let's make a symbolic link for the binary execution again with the following command. The command is ln hyphen s. I'm creating a soft link ln hyphen s tilde dot tfenv bin folder to usr local bin. So here we have successfully installed tf and tool command. Let's verify the installation installation using the following command tfenv hyphen v version here you can see that it's installed successfully now move to the next step which is check available terraform version using tfenv command line tool so now we have seen how we can install tf environment tool let's dig into the tf environment command the first command which we are going to see is tfenv list remove list list hyphen remote once i press enter see what happens up here you can see the above command will show the list out of all available version of terraform up to date see these all are the different different versions are there got it and number versions are available suppose if you want to install a specified version for say 0. Point, uh, like this 0. 0.12.20 or 12.10 something like that so we can use the following command like this way terraform environment install 0.12.0 so once i press enter it will install the specified version so it will install 0.12.0 version but i'm not going to press enter because i want to install the latest one so for that what i will do i will 
remove this one and for upgrade the latest data conversion using this command line tool Terraform provide the latest flag L-A-T-E-S-T latest flag which can be done using along with this command line tool and it will let you install the latest stable version of Terraform so I'll go with T-F-E-N-V install latest press enter here you can see that downloading begin version 1.6.0 so yep successfully done so here latest world version downloaded and updated successfully and i got the final message installation of terraform 1.6.0 successful to make this your default version use terraform env use 1.6.1 so let me copy and paste it here press enter switch now you can see uh, it switched to the latest version let's come out this terminal and check the version again so i exit open a fresh terminal activity terminal and now let's verify again with terraform version terraform iphone v earlier i got the message now you can see the latest one is successfully installed terraform version 1.6.0 so here you can see it's updated one similarly you can uninstall the latest one and again go back any older stable version also as your choice so for more information take the help from the available command tfenv env hyphen hyphen help so here you can see that the syntax tfenv command line tool plus options so commands we have many commands options are available like we can install we can uninstall we can list remote version of available terraform so guys this is how it's very small video and you can uh, you can update our terraform version using terraform env command line tool that's all about this demo finally this is the end of this topic hopefully you enjoyed and learned new things soon i will come up with another new interesting topic till then keep practicing if you feel something i have missed or you wanted to know more something else please reach out through my social media links which is mentioned in the description if you like this video please do not forget to like share and subscribe my channel and press the bell icon button for the latest update thanks for watching stay safe